In this video, you will learn how to set up the BCC50 Wi-Fi thermostat through the initial setup configuration process. Step 1. If you haven't downloaded the Bosch Connect Control smartphone app from the App Store, please do so now. You will need the mobile app to complete the initial setup and configure the BCC50 thermostat for your home's HVAC system. Go to the Google Play Store or Apple App Store to download the app, create an account, and finish configuring your system. Step 2. After downloading the Bosch Connect to Control app, open the app on your smartphone and click the register button to create a new account. Step 3. Read and accept the terms and conditions and privacy policy, and then press continue. Step 4. Follow the on-screen instructions to create your account and press OK at the bottom of the screen. Step 5. After a successful registration, you can use your newly created user ID and password to log into your account. Step 1. To add a new device, sign into the app using the user ID you created in the app setup. Select the Add New Device option on the screen to configure the new thermostat. Step 2. Select the device BCC50. Step 3. Make sure your mobile device is connected to the 2.4 GHz channel of your home's Wi-Fi network and then click Next. Note, click Skip to set up your thermostat without connecting to a Wi-Fi network. Step 4. If not already populated, enter the SSID and password of your home's Wi-Fi network and then click Connect. Step 5. On your thermostat, click OK to initiate the thermostat hotspot. Return to your app and use the QR scanner to scan the QR code on the setup screen of your thermostat. This will automatically copy the SSID and password of the thermostat to your app. Note, you can also use the up and down arrows on your thermostat to display the SSID and password for manual entry in the app. Step 6. Click copy to copy the hotspot password to your clipboard. Step 7. Leave the BCC app and go to the Wi-Fi settings page of your mobile device. Select the hotspot SSID in the following format, BCC50 underscore XXXX. Step 8. Paste the password from your clipboard and click connect. Note, it may take up to a minute for your mobile device to connect to your thermostat. Step 9. After your mobile device has connected to the thermostat, the thermostat will display you are connected to the app. Please follow the guided setup process in your app. Step 10. Return to the BCC app and click Next to continue the initial setup. Follow the on-screen instructions to name your thermostat and then click Next. Step 1. To configure your equipment, you will need to select the heat type according to the heating appliance in the home and configure the applicable settings. If you are unsure of which options to select, contact your local contractor or our support line, 1-800-283-3787. Step 2. After setting up your heating type, click Next at the bottom of the screen to continue. Step 3. Select your stage configuration according to the heating and cooling appliances you have in your home and then click Next. Step 4. If you have a whole home humidifier or dehumidifier accessory wired to your thermostat, Select the type of accessory you have in your home. Otherwise, click None. Step 5. You have now successfully completed the unit configuration of your BCC50 Wi-Fi thermostat. Click Next to continue with the initial setup. To set up the date and time for your thermostat, follow the on-screen instructions of your BCC app. After you have successfully configured the date and time, click Next to continue with the initial setup. Setting a schedule will allow you peace of mind knowing that your thermostat is following your desired heating and cooling preferences. Step 1. Choose the schedule you would like to modify or click plus to create a new schedule. You can also select none if you do not wish to set up a schedule at this time. Step 2. To set up your periods of the day, click on the start time bubble of the period and use the scroll wheel to set the start time of the first period of the day. Step 3. Next. Click the heat bubble and use the scroll wheel to set the heating set point for the first period of the day. Step 4. Then click the cool bubble 
and use the scroll wheel to set the cooling set point for the first period of the day. Step 5. If you want to add more periods, click the Add Period button and repeat the previous three steps until you've set all your periods for the day. You are only allowed a max of 8 periods per day. If you would like to delete a period, swipe left on the period and click Delete. Step 6. After you've set up one day of the week, use the copy section to mirror the same daily schedule to other days of the week by clicking on the days you would like to copy that daily set of periods and click copy schedule. Step 7. When you're finished editing your schedule, click save in the top right hand corner of the app. Note, for a new schedule, if you have not copied your schedule to all seven days of the week, you will be required to repeat the above setups until you have a set schedule for every day of the week. Review your BCC 50's initial setup configuration. If you would like to change any of the settings, click on the section you would like to change to be brought back to that section of the initial setup. If you are happy with the initial setup configuration, then click complete. Thank you for watching. If you need further assistance, visit our website or contact customer support.